doing today. So today uh, we got a little bit of a Mac tool haul. This has been over the past two weeks. So I got the new flyer. I figured uh, we'll take a look at that. This is good from December 23rd to January 2019. Um, they got some carbide end mills or carbide burrs in there. Now remember, if you're gonna buy them, if you're gonna buy these on the tool trucks, I suggest getting them from the Mac guy because they are lifetime guaranteed and you're gonna fuck these things up. So that's well value. A whole bunch of, uh, the next page is a whole bunch of Mac battery chargers. I ain't into that shit. Um, they got, uh, looks like a buy one, get one. So if you buy this spline adractor set, uh, you get some drill bits for free, left-handed, high-speed drill bits. Woo. So uh, that is, how much is that? 149 That's basically half off, and then you get the drill bits. That's not bad. I mean, the Irwin set on Amazon is 80 bucks, So you're basically paying 80 bucks for that and 80 bucks for the drill bits, if you look at it like that. Plus, you're supporting a local business. Um, they got some... Uh, uh, whatever this shit is, expert. They got some uh, 3 8 deep, and then you can get some extensions and uh, this little thing down here. Yeah, that's interesting. Alrighty. Um, so if you buy this pick set, you get this uh, mini pry bar set or the pocket screwdrivers, they like to call it, but uh, I'll show you those in a second. Uh, not the pick set, because I didn't buy that. Don't need that. Um, got some push button uh, circlips or you know circlip pliers. I don't recommend those. Uh, I like the Knipex or the Snap-on ones. To be honest with you, uh, they seem to be a little bit better. All right, we got a brushless electric battery set. We get a drill and uh, an impact driver for 429. Pass on that. Go Milwaukee. Uh, let's see here. <clears throat> you can get a digital multimeter, and then you get uh, a parasitic draw tester for free, and you can get a Mac low amp clamp, or AC-DC low current amp, amp, amp clamp uh, to plug into your fucking uh, thing. I have the Snap-on one. I actually like it. Um, next one we got is Air Tools. Uh, you buy this thing for 319 bucks, and you get a set of stubby metric impact sockets for your 90 degree thing. I, uh, I have this. It's Ingersoll Rand. I bought it on Amazon for 279 bucks. So another 50 bucks in the socket. That's a pretty good price. Uh, mini air ratchet. Not into those. Now this thing looks kind of interesting. It's a uh, Quarter inch, three eighths, compact air ratchet. That doesn't look that bad. Uh, let's see what else we got here. Uh, we got this fucker, high performance, whatever. Uh, I'm not really interested in that. Um, let's see what we got here. Uh, this is long reach, um, expert wrenches. The downfall on these is they're kind of expensive for flex heads. And um, it looks like their spline side, or this is, the ratcheting side is splined, and the regular ones are six point. I'm not really, I'm not at all good on those. Um, they also have this uh, stubby ratchet set. Um, again, I don't know about all that. Uh, I don't like the six point. I like the 12 point ratchetings. All right, uh, then you got, you can buy Bear Tool 239. Uh, I don't know if this is the high torque, no, this is the mid torque. Okay, ratchet for 239. Uh, you can buy Big Dick Banana Hammock Tool only, okay, for 250, I think, from an authorized retailer. So just do that. And these flex things, yeah, I'm not into that. All right, we got uh, Ball Allens. Got, they got those on promo, save 10 bucks basically. Uh, you get some uh, four amp hour batteries and a charger. 
Again, I don't know why you would buy all that. And then, you know, typical Mac shit. They got some shirts and some utility blades and all that stuff. And uh, if you guys want a bag to uh, wheel your shit around, you know what I'm saying? Okay, hold on here. Find Doug Coletta's Mac Tools Dragster. Find it hidden in this flyer. Check the next flyer for results where it is in flyer number 13. Page f Oh, I guess this is from last week. So you're, you must be able to find the Mac Tools Dragster in here. And, uh, do you win anything? Do you win anything? Eh. I didn't know they had that going on. I threw my other flyers away, so... Huh. Alrighty. Oh, alrighty, let's get into what I bought this week. I bought a digital uh, tire depth gauge uh, because mine uh, walked away. Let's see what we can do here. Mine uh, walked away. I didn't have a digital one, uh, but I wanted, uh, I wanted uh, a tire gauge uh, for checking for checking tires and uh, all that stuff. So it comes in fractions, millimeters, and inches. I don't know how much I paid for that, but you know, it is what it is. It was something hanging on the wall. There is the old part number right there. That was one of the things. Uh, the next thing that came in, this came in last week. I got my son a pajama set. Um, he's in three T's. Um, I wanted to get this for him. I like. You know, Enzo is, uh, he loves to fix things around the house. So we got that. That was awesome. Uh, <clears throat> this I bought from my Mac Tools man last week. Um, this is one of these NOCO uh, battery things. It is the 150. Um, I bought this to do cars and pickup trucks up to 10 liters. Um, I have the big one for the big dump trucks. Uh, that I got from Jason, my Snap-on guy. So I thought I'd share the love and get this one from uh, my Mac guy. I've actually used this on my dad's car. The battery was dead. Uh, these are the best jump boxes uh, known to fucking man, these NOCO ones. I think it was like 400 bucks for this thing, which is not bad because it's you can just throw it in your car and you got it. You know? Great little thing. Also... I bought this last week. This is ratcheting uh, stubbies. Okay, now really, I probably only should have bought the three quarter uh, because that's the one I use. See, I got 12 point. This is the three quarter one here. Um, these are the little patrician torque sets, but um, what pisses me off is Snap-on does not make these uh, in the 15 degree offset with uh, 12 point and reversible. I like reversible. These work great on taking uh, PTO hydraulic pumps off the PTO on dump trucks. This size particularly, because uh, there's one bolt that's really tight to get to. Um, I got the metric set coming to these two. Uh, it just didn't show up. Um, let me get you, you won't be able to see the part number, but it's real small on there. But they do make these in 12 point. I suggest going with the 12 points. I like those a lot better. All righty, back to this week. I bought these pry bar little sets. I had a guy send me a picture of this on Instagram and I thought he sent it to me somewhere. I don't remember who the guy was or whatever. Um, but these are these little, look at this little thing. Look at this little pry bar and this pocket screwdriver. I thought these would be great for helping uh, getting off uh, sensor plugs and stuff like that. So I said, yeah, go ahead and give me that. I need that. Um, let's see, there is the part number SDP2. Uh, I think these things were like 20 bucks. 
I tell you, some of the best $20 I've ever spent. <clears throat> Alrighty, the next thing I got is Mac drill bits. These are for the service truck. Um, don't need anything too crazy. I have a stubby set up there. Um, I bought the cobalt ones. Um, I seem to like those better. Um, this is just a uh, little bit of drill bits they have in the service truck. And why I bought Mac again, guaranteed for life. Don't matter if you fuck these up, they'll give you a goddamn nether one. This is a great deal, okay? This is about the best deal I found on drill bits. If you're looking to warranty them, go to the Mac truck. The only way to go. All righty, the last thing I got is again, there was people saying that the Mac long pliers are the shit. So I got these long Python uh, reach pliers, 16 inch. Um, it came in a set. So I got a straight one and I got uh, this one. So, you know, I'm pretty much pliered out right now. Um, I pretty much have every pliers uh, known to man. Uh, these things are made in China. I really don't give a shit, but you got pliers. If they get fucked up, they're warranty. All righty, the next thing I bought is I missed this deal, or I almost missed this deal. Um, it was the Precision Torque saw, uh, Wrenches set, six through 32. Uh, it only skips 29, but I've never seen a 29. All right, Precision Torque Wrenches. And for the price that Mac had on these last month in the flyer, it was almost like, oh my God, you're gonna give me wrenches almost half off. Uh, and I get this little, and I get this little tool bag. I mean, uh, yeah, this is, uh, it was, it was my mistake for not getting them. Now, I will tell you, <clears throat> I'm kind of interested in these uh, Mac ones. Uh, you know, I kind of like how this offset is on these precision torques. And I realize I probably could have got these from Falcom or somewhere else, uh, you know, on Amazon. <laughs> <clears throat> for the same price, but um, my dealer sold out of these instantly. He had 10 sets. I forgot to ask him the week that he was here. The next week he came back, he didn't have them. I almost fucking forgot. Uh, I asked him about it because I thought about it and I said, man, that's such a good deal. I got to get these. So um, he called around and found a guy that had these and he went up and got them. Okay, he had to drive to Dayton to get these fucking things. And he lives in Cincinnati. So it cost him 50 miles to go get these things. And, uh, you know, I, I greatly appreciate that. He went the extra mile. Um, that's the kind of thing that I'm always constantly working on, building these tool man relationships. So that's uh, what I've got over the last couple of weeks from Mac. Uh, you know, he will not be here for a couple of weeks because of Christmas and New Year's and stuff like that. And there's really nothing in the flyer. So I think the next couple of weeks we'll just be getting a receipt. Um, but other than that, that's what we got. Hopefully the next flyer is a little bit better. Or I find some other stuff to order. He said that they'll usually put the SAE set of these on, or, or, you know, on promo in the second quarter. So I'm going to look to get those uh, whenever they come. Oh my God, I almost forgot. Also... I ordered this Mac Tool stool a couple, I don't know, a month ago, and it finally came in. I wanted a stool out here with a back, and uh, I got this Mac Tools one. Um, I really like these Mac Tool stools over the other ones. You know, like that one that I got over there is awesome. Um, this also has an industrial, an, an, an adjustable back, so you can, uh, you know, screw that in and uh, get it comfortable for you. So I wanted something out here that I could sit on. Um, it also has leveling legs. It goes up and down. Oh yeah. But I got this stool too, and it finally came in. I'm super jazzed about it. Now I can sit out here and be comfortable if I'm working at the workbench or anything like that, making some uh, wiring harnesses or any bullshit like that. But uh, also got this. I don't know the part number or what it is. It's in the Mac catalog. Check it out. But uh, I'm super jazzed to have this 
I almost forgot about it. <clears throat> but uh, like always, check out Instagram, Patreon, Facebook, all that bullshit. And uh, like always, thanks for watching. And uh, I got to fucking go.